Welcome back everyone to some more Ancestors Legacy. So I'm literally now just recovering from being ill for the past a week. Um, I've been having problems with my ears so I went to the doctors and got some ear drops and I struggled just to do anything guys. My ears were killing so it's a little bit better now so which has allowed me to actually make a video here. Uh, which is better. So thank you so much everyone for sticking along with my channel and supporting us while I've been really ill. But um, I'm back now and we are starting a new campaign on Ancestors Legacy with the Germans or the Holy Roman Empire. We're going to be starting with the Knights of the Cross, the Teutonic Order. And I'm um, looking forward to see how this goes. Again, this one has two campaigns. So it's got the Order and it's got Rudolf as well. So we're going to be playing both of those campaigns. But... We're going to start this one first and see what happens because it looks pretty cool. Alright, let's start the game and see what happens. In 1190, during the Crusades of the Holy Lands, a group of German knights created an organization called the Teutonic Order. Despite enjoying the plunders of war and conquest, the ultimate ambition of the Order was to create its own state. After a failed attempt in Hungary, which resulted in their exile in 1225, the Knights made yet another attempt in Prussian and Polish lands in 1228. Their official assignment was to Christianize the pagans living in there. To do so, the Knights led a cruel and devastating religious war. Those who resisted were murdered and their families forced into slavery. This was all done with the willing consent and knowledge of the Pope and the Emperor himself. At the age of 15, I became a victim of the Order's quest for a sovereign nation. I was taken away as I took lessons in Latin, German, and in the art of warfare. I became acquainted with the rules of the Order and was brought up as a follower of Catholicism and a devotee to God. During training, it became clear I had a talent for battle, though this talent would soon become my curse. The knights, having noticed my prowess for combat, ordered me to conquer all of Prussia. Madness, I thought. Yet as a Prussian nobleman, I knew the language of the people, and already had their trust. But at the time, I didn't know the knights would eventually ask me to betray my kinsmen. My journey began when I was called to meet the eminent knight brother Konrad von Tierberg. He had sought me out for my guidance in order to resolve conflict with one of their more stubborn Prussian tribes. My tribe. My own. Pokarvis. The last time I was here, I was 15 years old. A lot has changed. And hopefully, for the better. You there! Peasant! Come here. Helkus? My brother! So, the rumors are true. We thought you were long dead. Burka, I didn't recognize you. <laughs> well, God decided I would be more useful alive than dead. Will you accompany me to Pokarvis? But of course. Come now. Let's head to Pokarvis. I see you come armed. Should a monk wear a sword on his belt? Is the word of God not enough? The sword comes in handy sometimes. Not everything can be solved with words. Alright, nice. That looks pretty sick. Like when Knights Templars, basically. Oh man. Help! Help! See, brother? Now is a time when a sword comes in handy. Let's go. Oh, look at this, guys. <laughs> Uh, let's get redemption on. See this battle. Oh, go on, son. Go on. Go on, look at that, man. Oh, this guy knows how... This guy, oh, my God. This guy is brutal. <laughs> he knows how to fight. Come on. Go on, go on, go on, go. Just hide your sword everywhere, mate. Thank you, my lord. You have saved us and all our belongings. May God's blessing be upon you. What brings you to Pekarvis? I doubt it's a family matter. 
Rumors say the Order's nearby camp was attacked. I've been sent to investigate. Talk to Krauper, our village elder. He knows everything that happens in the area. He will help you. I cannot let you pass. There are too many bandits nearby. We will have to find another way in. I don't have time for this. We will deal with them ourselves. Come with me. This way! Alright, secure the farm nearby. Kill all the bandits. Oh Come my lords, are you kidding me? They're becoming more and more confident, these bandits. Like a hungry pack of wolves. There's so many of them. show them the error of their ways. Oh, <laughs> nice. <laughs> There's so many of them, though. Um, I might go with offensive. Yeah. Oh my god, there's so many. Where's my ally? Come on, dude. I need your help. <clears throat> come on, come on. Nice. Look at this mother, guys. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's so brutal. <laughs> that's so brutal. Look at him. He's still alive. He's still alive, though. Oh, he just got stabbed in the face. Oh, he's gone, though. Oh, this dude, this dude knows how to fight, man. Jesus. This game is very, very brutal on me. God, okay. Alright, let's um, take out the rest of these bandits. And then, um, I'm actually going to heal up because he took a little bit of damage there. That's mad, that's mad that how he just took out the whole entire squad there. Alright, nice. Um, we're about to heal up there. Uh, we're full healed up. Alright, nice. Let's take out the last of these bandits. <coughs> Um, come on, come on lads, come on, charge, actually shall I wait, because there's a, there's a big group there, I don't wanna, I don't wanna risk it, I don't wanna risk it, let's get you moving, and um, we'll try and take all the bandits a little bit over here, come on, let's get a nice attack, alright, charge, charge, throw, throw, go, 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 oh, nice, nice throw, <laughs> brutal man, brutal, if you heard that little snoring noise there, um, I do have my dogs out, so obviously our pugs in the snow a lot, so I do apologise if you heard that snow little mat laugh, well, it was pretty loud actually. If you heard that snow there, uh, it was actually my dog, so I do apologise for that. Oh, dude, look at that, man. I really wish they made, do you know what, playing games like this, I wish they made more games like this, but like, they did originally make a game called Kingdom Come Deliverance, which is a really good game. I don't know if he's played it, but they didn't make any more, and I was pretty disappointed. I wish they made another like series on it. That would have been really good. Going. Oh, not bad. Where did you learn to fight like that? In Magdeburg, under the watchful eye of my knight brothers. Ha! <laughs> If I knew the Order could turn me into such a warrior, I would have let myself be taken prisoner. The bandits shouldn't be a problem anymore. Open the gate! Move, move! Thank you for the company, Herkos. I'll head back home. If you have time, do come and visit. Going! Good lord, above, I'll be damned! Hercus, is that really you? This way! Good to see you too, Kraupa. I require your counsel. Word has reached me that the Order's camp was attacked. Is this true? It is true, yes, but we haven't seen any survivors. The camp is on the southern side of the Dark Forest. Bandits roam freely beyond the gates, attacking us incessantly. They even seized one of our nearby mines. <laughs> could you help a fellow Slav, Herkus? We'd be indebted to you if you could recapture our mine. I'll see what I can do about the mine. May God be with you. Going! Alright, so what I'm probably going to do yes. first is um, secure that mine that they just talked about and then go to our main objective because I think you get re like you know extra resources and stuff if you do these side missions, I believe. Alright, come on, Hercus. Let's go and take this mine. I don't know how one dude can, you know, take out a whole entire squad, but he did it before, so... Oh, God, here they come. Uh, it's not a full squad, I believe, so I mean... Well, my people do this. 
Uh, should we throw axes? No. Let's wait until they get a bit closer. Alright, they've turned around. Go, go, go. Take them out. Nice. Good, good tack, good tack. There's two left. Come on, Hercus. Let's take these guys out. Oh, no. Oh, no. Here comes back up. You should be able to take them out, though. Come on. You took out the other squad. He's, like, literally covered in blood, though, guys. That is so brutal, man. There's, no, there's two more squads down there as well. Uh, he's doing pretty well, actually, so far. He's managing to take out majority of these squads. Um, they're obviously just our bandit civilians. Apparently, he's, like, really well trained by the Order. So, obviously, he should be able to be fight a lot better than these guys. <laughs> no way. No mercy, guys. No mercy. Oh, nah. That is just literally brutal. That that is just ridiculous. Come on, let's get you moving up. I, I, honestly, though, these games are just mint. I mean, I love games that like have sword fights and stuff in, like um, Fort Honor as well. That was a really good game. I enjoyed that. This and way. I think like they had like they had knights. I believe they had Vikings and the samurai as well, didn't they? Um, so that was that was a really Whoa. fun game. I loved playing that. Uh, who should we go for? Should we go for these guys? Let's go for these first. They're patrolling the outside of the area. Um, let's take these out. Go on, charge. Uh, redemption, go, go. Oh, nice. <laughs> oh, no. I don't know why his teammate doesn't, like, stab you in the back when you're doing that, though, but, you know. <laughs> oh, nah, okay. That literally went through the jugular. Oh no! Like straight through his like throat. That was like brutal. All right, come on, let's get you, boy. Let's get you taken out and then secure this mine. Look at him. Charge! <laughs> in the head. He's like literally covered in blood. Like he's a proper massacre. Oh no! You literally have got nothing. Like, oh, dude, dude, did you see that? No way. He like flipped him over. The people of Pokarvis can use their mine again free of danger. He I literally oh no way. to investigate the attack. Oh, he literally flipped that dude over and like killed the man. That is so that, that's so Assassin's Creed right there, man. That is ridiculous. Alright, let's get you back home and actually let's go and secure that camp and see if there's any survivors. Brother Conrad, the camp was destroyed, but all the bandits are dead. A pity. We could have interrogated them for information. <laughs> no matter. We're headed to Pakavis. An important meeting is underway there. We'll rebuild our camp later. But first, to Pakavis. Schnell, lass uns gehen. Conrad. Mina. Alright, let's move our forces. Oh, look at that, guys. Look at these knights, though. This is actually what we want, guys, isn't it? I was like, at first, like, after we're playing the Vikings, I was like debating which campaign we should play. Why are these people being taken away? It's for their own good, Brother Herkos. Pay it no heed and focus on the task at hand. Like, literally. I was like, oh, I hope everyone chooses the German campaign because this campaign looks sick. And guys, it is. This is mint. So far, anyway. Look at these guys in like their white Templar outfits, man. You just see like assassins like come run at them and start like attacking them and that. That that would be ridiculous. Imagine if they had like a DLC like that, man. All right, boys, keep moving up. For the security of everyone, we've taken control of this village. Are they waiting for us? Yes, my lord. As you ordered, the village leaders are awaiting. Ready to leave. Gone right, ready. 
Are they all gathered at the inn? Yes, sir. They are. Please come in. They're getting impatient. That won't be necessary. Block the doors and burn the inn. Brother Conrad, what are you doing? Silence, Heracles. You haven't a clue what's going on here. We will not negotiate with these godless pagans. Our patience is at an end. Their villages will burn, and we shall take their lands. By sword and spear, as God wills us. The time for talk is over, Hercules. Now go! Come on, lads, take them out. There we go, nice. Let's get some resources. Alright, we need to take these archers out, they're destroying our men, come on. Come on, boys, let's take these archers out. Look at all these forces in here as well, man. Come on, nice, let's finish these off. <laughs> Look at these guys with the mass machetes, though. They're literally just destroying everything and everyone in their path. That is so brutal. Alright, let's go burn this little town area down. So there's A, B, C, and D. Uh, well, actually, no, sorry, there's B, C, E, D, and F. There's no A, F. Well, A is at the bottom. I believe A is like, you know, the, the one that we've already got. Or well, our allies have got. But there's A, B, C, and D, and F, which we can capture for resources, for villages. And then, obviously, at the very top where those circles are highlighted, I believe that's the enemy bases that we do need to take over. Come on, come on boys, let's get everyone moving up. The reason actually I started playing this game is because I used to play a lot of Dino you know, Total War Tiller and I was like, oh, I've got to definitely play this game. It looks so awesome and it is. We're breaking the terms of our peace. We've we spent the lives of far too many brothers to protect this damn peace. I don't expect you to understand, Neophyte. You were born of these lands. For all I know, you're a wolf in sheep's clothing. That's absurd. Then prove it. Ruben! Attack! Let's go! Alright, come on. Go we'll capture this village. I have lost uh, the other one, but I'm trying to capture the other ones. Come on, let's take this base out. Come on, guys. Let's move up. Uh, replenish your squads. Let's get some armor. Um, we've got some more troops. Let's attack their main base now on the right. There is three bases, so we need to take them out. Come on, archers. Start firing. Insane fire. Come on. Nice. Let's take these boys out while everyone else heals up. Nice. Sorry, that was my dog again. If you heard that massive snoring, uh, that was my dog, so I do apologize for that. Uh, I've got two of them actually, they're just lying on my bed, and then um, obviously the, the snow when they're asleep, so uh, it's a bit annoying, but you know, it's funny as well. Alright, come on, let's break the defenses. All our forces are moving into the base. Come on. Come boys, let's get these in. I want everyone in. I've got some archers and crossbows in the distance there. Uh, let's get these all moving into the enemy base. <clears throat> Come on, we should be able to destroy that. Alright, nice. What I want to try and do is take out their barracks. Um, let's destroy these towers as well, because these archer towers are very, very lethal to my infantry. Uh, Alright, boys, take these out. Come on, we need to take these archer towers out. They do a lot of damage to my infantry. Alright, okay. Here come the enemy squads. Oh, Jesus, there's so many of them. There's so many of them. Are you kidding me? There's so many. Okay, this is going to be a bit of an issue, but you know, oh well. Um, I'm going to keep my crossbowmen and archers to fire at these towers. I mean, they're, they're pretty dangerous for my troops. Let's get the archers moving into the base. Come on. Keep destroying it, keep destroying it, set it on fire. What else can we get? What else can we get? Get some more infantry recruiting. Um, 
because we're actually losing kind of a few squads here. We've only got two um, infantry squads, like for melee combat. Uh, we do have some spear squads, we have crossbows and two heroes, I believe, or generals, which are actually very brutal. Come on, nice, we've took that out. Let's finish him off. Alright, I'll use the barracks, take out the barracks. That's what spawns in squads and stuff. We can take out the barracks and they can't actually spawn more squads in this base. Oh, they've got some more reinforcements though. Come on, destroy it, destroy it, destroy it. It's almost destroyed. Nice, good job, good job. Nice, we've took out the barracks on this side so they can't get any more infantry, but they can still get archers. Um, so we know where the archer square, the building is that we need to take out. Let's get some more armor for you guys. <laughs> Look at him. Just charging into those infantry there. Nice. Oh, they've got more reinforcements, they've got more... This, the only thing I find a bit dumb about this game is, is that they spawn in enemy infantry like nothing, you know? It's like you take out like infantry and then spawning five more troops and it's like, how the hell are you supposed to take these guys out? And they just keep spawning in troops like that's nothing. It's a bit stupid though. That's the only thing I don't like about this game. But like, it takes you a long time to you know to train up troops to get them in the battle. Yet literally they poop them out like it's nothing. The enemy um, AI. It's uh, which I find a bit dumb. And it's a bit annoying, you know, when you're like trying to destroy stuff and that, and then you just have like a massive horde of infantry just come running at you and taking you out. Uh, anyway, we've almost taken these guys out. Anyway, come on. We're almost, he's almost done. Come on, boys. Come on, there's only one dude left. All right, nice. Take out this tower. We need to take out those towers. They're very brutal towards my infantry. All right, let's get you boys lined up. Come on. Why are you guys not shooting? Start shooting the towers. Insane fire. Actually, yeah, you take out the wells because those wells actually... Um, help the enemy bones, you know, not like burn as fast, it, it, it's a bit annoying, I'm gonna get my infantry to take that well out actually. <sighs> it's got loads of enemies coming at us guys, and I haven't got much infantry to hold them back as well, Jesus, we might have to fall back here. I might have to get my squads to fall back. did bring in some reinforcements, but I don't know if it's going to be enough. Come on. Come on, let's finish off this base. This base is so hard to take over, this mission. Is, this is actually the first mission as well. And it's like so hard to do because it just keep pooping out loads of reinforcements. It's so stupid. Come on. Come on, let's burn everything. Come on, guys. Come on. Let's destroy this base. They're actually training archers, as you can see there. So if we, we need to destroy this um, building before they manage to do that. Come on, archers, are you firing? Nice. You guys are firing. Good job, good job. Let's get an uh, um, insane fire. Uh, let's get all the infantry. Yep, they spawned in some archers, but I don't think they should have. Well, they're not great at melee combat. And here comes enemy reinforcements. Are you joking? Are you joking? I literally just cleared these dudes out and they're sending more reinforcements, guys. Come on. This is stupid, man. We literally just keep spawning in forces. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, yep, let's get you retreating. Retreat, retreat, get out of there. Hercus, we do want to lose you. Come on, dude. Alright, nice. I've got my crossbows actually flanking behind those infantry units, uh, which will help us get a, a lot more damage. Alright, let's get you healed up. Uh, you, you guys are still like just burning anything down like in this base it's pretty over p like but you know we've destroyed that well that we were trying to destroy earlier as well um before we had to retreat so that's good it doesn't allow the the civilians to stop the fires and stuff which is good right so they're just actually about to destroy the rest of this base nice good job leave none alive Believe not alive, yes sir. Alright, here comes the reinforcements again. Oh, God's sake. These literally send reinforcements every two seconds. It's so stupid. Alright, let's finish these boys off and then capture the rest of the two bases. Alright, nice. Come on, lads. 
Ah, it's so annoying. Come on. Almost finished them. Nice. Good job. He's gone. Good job, guys. Good job. All right, let's conquer the rest of the the bases, I believe. There's only two more. We, we need to actually take over, and then we can finish this mission. Alright, for some reason, it didn't actually show me, or well, it didn't actually record the part where I attacked the second base. We've actually took out two bases now. Um, I went across and took out the other one. For some reason, it didn't actually record that part, which I'm pretty annoyed about, but, you know, it's technical issues. Oh, it's so hard to talk when you've got, like, earache and stuff. Like, I've got my headphones on barely, but now and then I have to keep taking them off because, um, I obviously have to keep wearing, like, I keep putting drops in my ear. Um, to help my, my ears for like medication and stuff and it, it, it's so annoying but um, I haven't uploaded for a while so I was really trying to get a, a video up and running and, and continue our ancestors legacy campaign I really am enjoying the, the this kind of series at the minute we're gonna be I'm, I'll probably split the series up because all the campaigns are different, there's like slabs, um, the Saxons and all that kind of things. So I think I'm going to do different playlists for different campaigns. I think it'll make sense and obviously make the campaigns look a bit more professional, you know. I think I might do that. Alright, well, there's literally no enemies here, so let's just finish off the rest of this base. Come on, lads. Come on, just slaughter those civilians. <laughs> Come on, Templars, let's burn down this village. Come on, we're almost done. Nice, good job. Alright, there's actually still a village still up and running, but nice. This is not over. The people of Pokabis will suffer for their sins. Though they are servants of God, they took these pagans as their neighbors. And such sins will be paid for. Kill them all! Alright boys, charge! Come on, let's take these towers out. Oh my god, this is going to be an interesting battle. Oh, they've got so many archers. They've got like archer towers and all sorts, man. I'll use... We've actually got a kind of few archers, so hopefully they'll be able to take out those, um... Those towers are a lot easier. Come on, nice. Oh, that's literally already burnt down, man. That's literally already burnt down. Them towers though are very effective against infantry, so <laughs> you really want to make sure they're burnt down first, which they are. So let's continue our assault. They're bringing more of their reinforcements to try and defend, well, trying to stop us anyway from um, breaking through the lines. But we've got a kind of few forces here to take them on. Come on, nice. Come on. There's only a couple of infantry left. And we've got our archers literally firing support in the back there. And their infantry are literally getting destroyed by our archers. Uh, our archers are actually firing um, fire, I believe, fire arrows at these buildings as well from long distance, which is really good to take out these buildings here. Uh, once these buildings are out of the way, then that would be excellent. Come on. Panzer armor. I didn't realize this was World War Two. <laughs> there's a, he's a, that dude who we need to take out as well. He's I think he's the enemy general, I believe. Nice. Come on, let's just take out all these barracks. If we take out the barracks, then we can't have any more infantry to spawn. We've got oh, we've got one of those catapults as well. I think what, what are they called? A the treble or something? A treble. I don't know what the, actually their real name was. I know they are called catapults, but I don't know if they were called travelers or something as well. <laughs> Did you just see that archer dude just get wrecked? Go on, go on. Nice. He's he, he's gonna be dead soon. Like he's gotta be gone. Come on, man. Charge. Take him out. Oh, nice, sweet. We took out that general. Uh, let's capture their village, and I believe this should be the end of the mission, once you capture it. Is it? Maybe? I'm not too sure. Um, oh, they do have... Okay, it looks like we still need to destroy a couple of their buildings as well, I believe. Alright, come on. Set these houses on fire. Come on, troops. 
Come on, Knights Templars. It's almost finished. Town Hall. Destroy the Town Hall. Alright, okay. Everyone shoot the Town Hall. <laughs> that is ridiculous. Have you seen how fast they throw that? I mean, the archers. Have you seen how fast they shoot their arrows and like the guys who throw their torches at the bronze man? I love that. It's so funny. Look at that. So historically accurate though. What have you done? My friends, my family, everyone, they're all dead. And all in the name of God? I swear upon the gods of old and those of my ancestors that you will pay for this. I curse you to the end of time. You rue the day that you betrayed me, Conrad. Ha! So you show your true colors, Hermes. Such a shame you're not a true Christian. You never could be our brother. Take him and lock him in the dungeons. Not this time, old bastard. You'll have to wait. We will meet again. Well, everyone, that is it for this episode of Part on Ancestors Legacy. So what do you think of the first mission of the German campaign? I'm looking forward to see how this goes on this um, this campaign for the, the German or the, the Knights Templars. I'm looking forward to see how this goes, but I'm going to be doing a lot more videos, hopefully, of Ancestors Legacy. So if you want, hit that um, notification bell to keep up to date with the series. And um, I'm also going to be doing a lot more Minecraft builds as well for World War 2 and other wars and just other bits and bobs as well so um I'm looking forward to doing that for years all if you've got any suggestions of what you would like to see on my Minecraft war um world just put down in the comments below but thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one enjoy the rest of your day